Welcome to this presentation of Atlas 5 from Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. In this presentation I'm going to demonstrate using the column update feature of Atlas where for a given table Atlas can go and update a particular column uh, for, a for a given set of records. In my example I'm going to choose is actually a list of uh, customer credit rating and credit limits. What I'd like to be able to do is use the power of Excel to perhaps get some other information from AX to help me uh, manage these two columns um, more efficiently. I have here an example workbook where for a given customer group I have a list of customers and I like to manage the credit rating and credit limit. In this workbook I can go and change my customer group to customer group 10 and I can see here a list now of customers for customer group 10 for my default company. So I now have a list of customers for customer group 10, my wholesale customers. I want to manage my two credit limits and credit rating column. Uh, so what I can simply do in here is come in and as the field in AX is just text, I can really type in whatever I need. Um, so I'm going to say very good, excellent, perfect. It's really whatever I desire and maybe I will put in some credit limits of 50,000 and I'll just copy this down. Uh, for these ones a bit more, 250,000 and so forth. So once I'm ready to actually update AX uh, then I can do precisely that. So my credit ratings and credit limit has been set I now want to get this back into Dynamics AX. So I'm going to choose my upload table columns. Inside the workbook the definition has already been in place here that has my uh, mappings already in place so for instance for this range of accounts uh, found here I would like to set the credit limit to be this amount here and the credit rating to be this amount here. So this is so the left hand column is the field in AX, the right hand column is where is it on the workbook. So I simply have to do upload and the validation is done. Seventeen records have been updated. So what I can now do is have a look in AX, for instance, customer account 1103, CAVE wholesalers. So CAVE wholesalers, I shall double click on this. see some fields here of credit limit of 250,000 and a credit rating of excellent. So I, again I can edit this information, maybe I'll change this again to be 350,000 and call this an A++ credit rating. Uh, as I save my record back in my spreadsheet and I refresh my report. So this particular data in here is, is an Atlas report. As I refresh my report, that new figure has come in from Dynamics AX. So this has been a combination of using an Atlas list report to go and get me some cust a customer list for a given customer group. There are some uh, formulas over here or some balances over here that are coming for each customer. Again this allows me to do other things such as drill down to look at transactions that make up a balance. I can really build this up to be uh, whatever I need to do this particular task. So it's a much more efficient way than uh, working out how do I manage, for instance, what customers for customer group and then not having to go into the edit mode for each customer. Very inefficient. I'll be able to set them once uh, or manage them inside a spreadsheet and use the power of uh, 
this and Excel to get that information back into AX much more efficiently. Thank you very much.